Hi everyone, this is Tim at Makers Machining. We're here at Fabtech. We're over in the welding section here. And I know uh, Makers Machining is primarily about machining, but we've uh, met up with a couple of guys here in the welding area. And these guys are doing welding and we're standing over here. Right now they've got a podcast for Art Junkies uh, Welding. Uh, I'm gonna ask Brandon and Miguel here what they were interested in doing to get into welding and then how their experience with the show is here. So if you guys want to just chime in on what you uh, got going, knock yourself out. Uh, how long you been welding, Miguel? Uh, I've been welding for five years now. I mainly do TIG welding. I do some MIG. I've done a little bit of bark welding. So I stainless, stainless steel? Stainless you're doing? steel, okay. cast okay. iron, aluminum. And you've gone through an apprenticeship? Yep. So I'm you're a journeyman now? I'm a journeyman sheet metal worker. Okay. And, uh, and I've had a local 29, and uh, I've been there for five years now, and I really enjoy it. Excellent. So you, you've learned a good trade coming out of high school. You've got a good career ahead of you. Yeah. Brandon, have you gone through an apprenticeship, too? Uh, I've done an apprenticeship. I've done, I've, kind of, I've dabbled in everything, whether it be good. pipe fitting, uh, agriculture repair, uh, super high, high finished uh, architectural stainless steel aluminum. Now I work in uh, New York City for the power company there. This is a great, great power plant they need to do it. Rebuild pumps. So I'm a jack of all the Well, you're, you're from New York City. Miguel's from Wichita. I live in Chicago area. Uh, the point of all this is all you guys that are out there that are looking for what kind of work you want to do for your life, work, uh, here's these trades here. And at this trade show here, there is everything covered here as far as what techniques and processes there are and you can make a good living and have a good career it's rewarding work when you work with your hands so keep that in mind as you're going through your career options going forward there, there's a huge need right out there for people right now to do these trades works and it's not just welding and machining it's all the other trades as well so uh, there's a lot of options out there for you I know college is being pushed uh, on students quite a bit, but college isn't for everybody and college isn't required by every job. And boy, if you get some hands-on work, you can really have a good, rewarding career. Anything else you guys want to throw in here before we sign off? Got it all covered. Okay. All right. Maybe you can hand over and see they're uh, interviewing the uh, Art Junkies uh, podcast over there. It's got a pretty big crowd of people over there watching that. There's a lot of interest in all these different trades that uh, that we have here. This is a, a great opportunity to see what's going on in the world out there. Thanks for visiting with us today. We'll talk to you again soon. Hello.